What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another Let's Build an SLR. Today we'll be doing whatever is in the title. Uh, as you know, uh, I don't think these through very often. I just kind of go with the flow of life. But that's uh, whatever. And today we are, we are on SLRR. Uh, BB90s, 93s, um, JDM 90s legends. But, uh, roughly that. Roughly whatever I just said. So uh, we know high quality stuff we're about, to, uh, we're about to see some high quality stuff. So let's see what kind of cars we will be choosing today. I think I've done an R33 GTR lap, but like way back in the day. Yeah, let's go, let's go with a Soarer, with a SC300 Soarer. Ah, fuck dude, I really love these cars. It just it looks so, like in stock form, they look... Eh, you know, I can see, uh, I can see it becoming better. But once they got, they get torched up even a little bit, this becomes like a fucking sexy ass like Grand Tourer Coupe, man. Oh, lovely. But let's get into it. So when it comes to suspension, there won't be anything uh, absolutely new uh, or surprising. I'm just gonna check out what the car comes with. So it comes with absolutely nothing. That is exactly what I wanted to see. Right, so we have the normal, normal Mr. Sir 2s, always reliable, always good. We got greedy type R's this time, greedy, because um, they're cool, because they look cool. <laughs> We've got endless 358 millimeters on the front with just normal endless. Uh, now these are Brembo's 278s on 278s on the back, which is still a very significant break this has um this has you know if this was if this was what do you call it if this was automation the game would be calling uh, will be telling me uh we've got too much stopping power we've got too much stopping power and uh but that's fine that is all fine we've got some bbs lms just so we have any so we have like good looking tires on the car and rims and to be fair like this looks already banger except the fucking white body but let's go on to the engine and i've got I've got a different idea for this engine. So we have the SC300. Where's the engine? Oh, why did I remove the hood? So we have the NA2J, right? So NA2J with probably an automatic. I can't fucking tell. That looks like a proper shifter, bro. So I have the NA2J with a with a manual. So Evan Shanks got one of these and basically did a turbo conversion and he had a, b a few issues here and there right straight from an na to turbo conversion or maybe that was his i don't remember maybe he his was a two uh, twin turbo one doesn't matter i think it wasn't what if this is not an sc300 even though it says so on the back what if this is a sc400 and sc400 or 430 something along those lines what if this is right what if this is a 2u zffg 2u z uh, uh, the fucking the Toyota to the Toyota Turbo the Toyota V8 yeah right to you to use the exactly Lexus stock engine Toyota stock engine we can all always go with a 1J or some ridiculous shit but I think I'm gonna go with a supercharged to use the heavy not a supercharged a supercharged so it's different just so it's different so this is an SC 400 430 whatever it was I don't remember because it's a little less interesting. Right, this should work now. There we go. That kind of looks a bit strange. Oh, well, that's... It's not fitting perfect. Also, this looks like significantly smaller than a 2J. Very form factor, very nice form factor. Uh, it's got rusted fucking exhaust headers. That's always perfect. We got a small pulley. What a fucking tiny little pulley. That is a small boy. Small, small boy. Right, now we have the engine, but we're not done with that, because I don't like that airbox, it kind of looks ugly. Right, well, I did not find a uh, air filter, so um, I guess that we're stuck with this. Also, this is a TRD, that's pretty cool, that is pretty cool. So if, what if we remove that? Can the car run? No. Nope. Okay, then, fine and perfect, like, we don't... Come on, I'll, I'll keep it, I'll keep it, it's just more uh, elegant that way. Oh my gosh, so fucking ugly. No, the... the like this is not fitting at all. This does not fit the car. Like straight up. Can I angle this thing? Like fucking. Right. I guess we don't have an airbox anymore. Just straight up open to the wind. That's not great, but it's not terrible either. 
We're fine because it's very low, as you can see. You know, it's actually lower than the car, but that's fine. <laughs> it's fine. This is SLRR. Ha! <laughs> Great. This is, is the best we can do. Right. What kind of power are we making? What do you mean 1,000 horsepower? Come on, man. That's stupid. I don't want a 1,000 horsepower like Gran Tourer. I want this to be like an epic car. It does epic things, but fucking 1,000, 1,000 is way too much. Does this not have like a modification? Right, well, I'm going to act like it's not 1,000 horsepower because it's fucking annoying. I, I don't want to go with a turbo. I just want the end supercharger because it's a bit cooler. Right, let's go into the next part. So I want this car to be uh, somewhat clean, somewhat nice. It's going to be a, you know, a nice Grand Tourer after all, but it's got to look good. Fuck man, the SC300 looks so good, especially once you just change the bumper, it just looks so nice. What the fuck is this supposed to be? <laughs> oh man, that's a big oof. Yeah, I definitely think the f this one is... I definitely think this one will be the one. Ah, oh, yes. Right, so I found one drift quarter panel. One, just one. Right, I was hoping for white body, but... Normal body. Why is my car like not even in position? How did it move so much? Side skirt 2 versus side skirt 3. I don't know, man. I really like the side skirt 3 version. What's happening here, bro? Oh, is this supposed to be slightly wider? I think it is. How do you. Let me remove these. Yeah, it has an ever so slight lip. It has like, a tiny lip. I don't like that. We're going stock body on this one. Don't really doesn't really fit right now, but that, that that's, didn't look too good that one. Hmm. Uh, it doesn't really fit with the line of the car, but I like how it looks. Kind of, I don't think it's, it's got to be the one. This is the one. I'm gonna go with because it has, it has the lip. It's got it's, it's clean, it's clean, it's clean. I like that. Well, I think I mean that's pretty much done with this one. Doesn't have too many parts, but uh, it's got enough parts for it to be quite interesting. Very sad that we don't have any uh, windows or anything of the sorts. Tail lights. I really like those twin tail lights where it splits. Oh man, those are the fucking those are the best uh, tail lights. But we don't have any, so we should probably throw on a line licentian plate. Right, so the car currently has a plate somewhere in it. Um, sadly, I cannot find it. Very, very sadly. It is uh, it is not anywhere visible. I looked at the trunk, I looked everywhere. Like, is somebody, is somewhere in here, in in the depths of the car where I cannot touch it. So it's uh, very hidden and I cannot install a second plate. So it doesn't matter. Right, it does not matter. Cool, cool. So I'm debating on changing the seats because these look quite comfortable, right? Because this is still, even though it says 100,000, 1,000 horsepower, it's uh, in reality 50, right? It's 50 horsepower and it's got the Grand Tourer. I want this to be like a good trip car. I want, I want you to be able to drive this car, right? Oh, this doesn't have any buttons. This is the... Oh no, it, it's actually connected. I, I want the cruise control to be connected. <laughs> is ridiculous as that sounds but I found these seats and maybe they're not that bad but I, I don't want to deal with them so fuck it <laughs> fuck it dude fuck it dude. I'm gonna leave it as that I'm gonna leave it as that but we got we got still some work to do like fixing it got some suspension I absolutely love how the LMs l uh, sit, sit on this car though and I might keep them what do you guys think I don't know I quite like the way it looks the suspension wise now it's got a clean it's got a clean stance, but it's a bit too low. I'm gonna raise it a bit because it's uh, nose diving very hard. Right, I think that's slightly cleaner. It just doesn't. It doesn't look like a BMW nose diving all the time. Still, still got that. Still got that line, but it's fine. It's fine. Maybe need a bigger spring, but eh, we don't need to do that. We don't need to do that. No, there's very little left, like exhausts and paint, of course.
right i think that's good i think that's good it's clean it's massive it's not aggressive i like that i do like that can i remove these probably not i guess it's just gonna say sc300 even though it's a it's an sc400 i'm just gonna check for uh, just in case but i doubt it very much doubt it right i think this is pretty much it it's a super super clean sc300 this is a very nice black paint it's got that oh it looks beautiful i've got the, i've got purple brake calipers look at how big that is man. look at how big that is. maybe that's a bit of an overkill to be frank but that is fine it just looks very clean i would love to have put some more accents on it but uh, we're going completely black and if I could paint this, I would paint it purple, but I can't. So uh, I'm gonna leave it as is. I think the car, the car looks fucking amazing, if you ask me. The car looks absolutely amazing. Look how clean it is, bro. Oh my god, damn. This is a f this is an absolute looker, an absolute looker. If I only had the twin tails, man, bro. Oh my god, and a bigger lip spoiler, uh, but we don't have any of those. Damn, I love the SC300. Let's go and take it out for a spin. We out here on Sukuba. Let's see how the car you know, performs. Should now in a straight line, it feels. Oh, 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 oh. Of course, this is still like 500, 600 horsepower. Ignore the 1,000 horsepower. Not real. Fake news. Oh shit! Please stop. Right, well, I didn't stop exactly, but car still pretty good. No sound, perfectly electric and all that good stuff. Tesla. It can power slide, but it's not a drift car. But that's exactly what we want. We want some power slides, but we don't want the uh, unsta instability of a oh drift car. Let's see how let's see how it does on top sp on, on speeds. Like, and imagine this is the autobahn. Like, this is the autobahn going. We're going very slow for the autobahn. Right, it's not very fast. Like, it's only 500 horsepower. Under steering and all that good stuff. I mean, the car is the car is pretty. Oh, sick! If you ask me, I, I really love this car. Really love how it. I mean, driving is irrelevant. I'm just imagining driving it in real life. Now that's. That's where you win with this car. That's where you win driving this in real life. But yeah, guys, if you want to see anything special for next episode, any different car, uh, just uh, put it in the comments, and I will see you in the next one.